This is Micah with Silicon Valley Global News. I am here trying the latest uh, technology with uh, Varho. Uh, this is cloud streaming technology. Today uh, I'm going to experience what could be the future of the metaverse, the future of WebXR, the future of AR and VR, all of that. Uh, I'm going to see and you'll see what I see uh, in this video. Uh, a uh, car is going to appear in this space behind me and uh, it's going to be incredible. I've, I've, I've taken a quick peek and I, I'm going to go back in right now. So this is it. This is the Varro, Varro Mixed Reality Experience. All right. So there it is. I see the car. Okay. And uh, with me, who's going to help help guide me? Uh, Erho Contori. Hey. Did I say right. it correctly? Yeah. Urho. Yeah. Really well. So so. Uh, welcome, and today we're basically showing for the first time the Warrior Reality Cloud, which is our cloud streaming solution that enables you to have always, always equal experience, no matter what kind of device you have as the client device, you always have access to the perfect image quality without any of the hassle of actually maintaining separate computers or applications, like a dream come true for the IT industry, uh, like IT management in the enterprises. Yeah. So uh, additionally, it allows us to get the infinite scalability of the cloud platforms, of course. And our cloud is running on AWS, which means that we have regions which are always close by for low latency link to wherever you are globally. Uh, and we're going to be launching first in USA uh, on the 28th of uh, April, and then expanding very soon after to Europe and later on to Asia Pacific markets. Wonderful. All right, let's take a look at this. Uh, yeah. this so, on your right, you see a car. Uh, let me bring it a bit closer to you, so like this. Yep. And um, as a car designer, you're of course always interested in how your actually your design actually looks like. So um, what this allows us to achieve is simple link set if you believe. So uh, you can get their feedback, their comments, everything prepared, no hassle, and then always in perfect detail. Um, so you want to look at the different color palette of the car, you're doing it. So, so I just want to uh, say to folks that I, I've tried the Varho headsets before, and this is has always been like the highest resolution mixed reality, widest field of view experience. There's just nothing else approaching it. But what's different this time is this is streaming from the cloud. This, they, they have, the, the team at Varho has solved a problem that other major VR companies haven't solved yet. Uh, which is the, the ability to deliver these kinds of graphics uh, over the web. We don't only do mixed reality, we also do VR, so we can actually take you to uh, jump into the uh, virtual reality world. So now we are in uh, uh, Berlin, in a market square, so the place is totally different. The colors, the reflections play out very differently in this world, so yeah. we're able to get like go through these design choices the same way uh, as before. Wow, so what I'm seeing are uh, reflections. And these graphics are amazing. This is human eye resolution. This is like, this is what we've been waiting for. Woo! <laughs> 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 Very good. Okay, so this news story today, as amazing as this headset is, this is not about the headset. This is about the Varho Reality Cloud, which enables you to <laughs> basically take this quality of VR experience and bring it to any headset, any AR headset, any VR headset, uh, to phones, to tablets, to computers, uh, so that you, uh, you can experience this kind of high resolution uh, quality of augmented reality and a virtual reality from any device. That's why the Varco Reality Cloud is a whole new product that uh, has the potential to scale even larger than, uh, than, than a VR headset can scale, because it can reach so many more devices. So we built now, uh, I think on your right, you should be able Whoa. to see oh my gosh. her, yes. who is a meta-human running on cinematic quality settings, so not the, like the real-time settings, but cinematic quality settings in the Aria Reality Cloud. So, uh, Epix, meta-human. Yeah, uh, Unreal, so, so uh, meta-human is, is a product that uh, the Unreal Engine folks uh, Epic uh, helps uh, create and bring to the world, and you get really high resolution 3D avatars that are just uh, startling 
in terms of like I haven't seen the metahumans uh, in person yet, but now I am I'm seeing them like life size in front of me, and this is uh, a very impressive experience. Yeah, it's kind of different than what you're seeing with the uh, very cartoonish depiction. I can actually enable the camera position if you want to have a uh, sure. feeling of that one. Yeah. Um, so it's. Uh, there you go. Now the hand occlusion is also on, so that it's utilizing the segmentation of things that are uh, like at uh, different depth settings. They are behaving. You can actually put your hand through the model, and it's going to disappear at the place that it intersects with wow. this uh, model. So yeah. it really works. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Uh, this is gonna. This is going to uh, like. When you play an RPG, when you play uh, a, uh, you know, whatever game you want, the experience of interacting with non-player characters, or even with, with other characters who have avatars of this quality, um, it's just, it's visceral in a way that you've never experienced before if you haven't tried this. Uh, it's, yeah, I'm, I'm impressed. <laughs> yeah. So it is, it is interesting, so uh, there is nothing fundamentally saying that the metaverse should look like cartoons. It right. can be fully photorealistic and warrior reality cloud and similar systems could uh, enable the same thing. So allowing you, allowing you to tap into enough compute that you jump from cartoons to something real like. And, and we have always wanted to do these kind of leaps as a company and we believe that this is one of those leaps in the metaverse that needs to be taken before we start taking metaverse in series. Yeah. So, so here we are, a metaverse that makes sense. Yeah. Avatar is part of the metaverse. Yeah, and the real point is that uh, this is streaming over Varho Reality Cloud. This is not a local uh, VR experience. So you wouldn't even need to have your own uh, PC at this point, because yeah. you can stream it. Absolutely, absolutely. And you could have experiences that are comparable to having your own PC. Um, yeah. Very high-end PC. Over the web. A very high-end PC. Yes, yeah. exactly. Yeah.